Hey gamer, let's take a sail down the legendary river of the Rokinong in Rivers of Gold. Produced by Office Dog Games, this is a game for two to four players and plays about 60 to 90 minutes. And honestly, it's probably more on the 60 minute side. It's a very short game. There's very simple rules. You start with these boats on this beautiful river. This game has this lovely foil river that you're going to sail down. On your turn, you're going to roll the die. That die is going to determine the area that you can build in, the type of merchant that you can deliver to, or it has a number on it for how many spaces down the river you're going to sail. When you reach the bottom of the river, you're going to start again at the top. As you sail down the river, the places that you stop have buildings on them that you have built. There's also some starting buildings as well. These buildings give you resources, and if you are the owner of the building, you get a bonus resource. And then a double bonus if you happen to be the person that's landing on the spot and the person that owns it. You're going to get both sides of the building. When you deliver to the merchants, you're going to get some special abilities, and you're going to get influence in that area. The person with the most influence in each area is going to get points at the end of the game, as well as points that you're going to get throughout the game. The person with the most points wins. Surprise! Uh, I love this game because it's just such an equal, simple setup. It's very pretty. I have no idea what The Legend of the Five Rings is. Sorry, nerds that might know. But, you know, I'm a sucker for a pretty game. The insert is also really cool. It's this nice foily gold type of thing. And everything has actually managed to stay pretty well put in here. Uh, with the boards on top and then I put the meeples on top to keep the lid really well shut and so I store my games mostly vertically and so that actually keeps it well in place. Definitely give this game a check out. Uh, the price point was also really good uh, and if you're a fan of The Legend of the Five Rings, I hope it does you justice. Let me know in the comments below. We will see you next time.